Wilton is a town nestled in the Nork River Valley in southwestern Connecticut in the United States. It is located in Fairfield County. As of the 2010 census, the town population was 18,062. Wilton was officially recognized as a parish in 1726. The original 40 families of the parish began their own congregational church and were allowed by Nork to hire a minister, open schools and build roads. During the Revolutionary War, in 1777 the British used Wilton as an escape route after their successful raid on Danbury. Several homes were burned, but the town remained intact. In 1802, Wilton was granted a town charter by the Connecticut General Assembly and became a political entity independent from Nork. With a strong anti-slavery sentiment by its residents, Wilton served as a stop on the Underground Railroad. Today, Wilton, like many other Fairfield County towns, is an expensive residential community with open lands, historic architecture and extensive town services. Residents commonly commute to New York City, Stamford, and Nork, although there are a number of office buildings in town. Wilton was rated one of CNN's top 25 towns to live, boasting an average household income of over $300,000 per family. AIG Financial Products was headquartered in the town. Its trading and credit derivatives essentially bankrupted its parent company, AIG, and helped create the global financial crisis of 2008 Euro 2009. Wilton is also home to Cannondale Bicycle Corporation, Melissa and Doug, and the Blue Buffalo Company. Also, recent developments in town include the expansion of the Nork River Valley Trail, a multi-use trail that is designed to eventually run between Nork and Danbury. History For more information, History of Wilton, Connecticut, Wilton was classified as a dry town until 1993, when the local ordinance was altered to permit the sale of alcoholic beverages in restaurants. The town was then referred to as damp. On November 5, 2009, a referendum proposal was passed to allow liquor stores. The town board enacted an ordinance to allow liquor stores to sell alcoholic beverages in 2010, and several stores have since opened. Geography According to the United States Census Bureau, the town has a total area of 27.4 square miles, of which 27.0 square miles is land and 0.4 square miles, or 1.50 percent, is water, including the South Nork Reservoir. Wilton is bordered by Ridge Eel to the northwest, Nork to the south, New Cannon to the southwest, Westport to the southeast, and Western and Reading to the northeast. It is also bordered on the west by the hamlet of Vista in La Wisborough, Westchester County, New York. The scenic Ridge Yield Road offers a look at many historic homes, places, and sites. The latitude of Wilton is 41.201 n. The longitude is minus 73.438 w. Equals housing stock and land use equals. Wilton has, by some estimates, more than 500 restored 18th and 19th century homes, although demolitions of old houses have been problematic, as Marilyn Gould, a Euro Wilton second selectman and director of the Wilton Historical Society, a Euro told the New York Times in 2005. People aren't taking down historic houses but the more modest homes that were built in the 50s and 60s, she said. What that's doing is changing the affordability of the town and the demographic of the town. Wilton used to have a wide demographic of people who worked with their hands, artisans, builders, mechanics. Now it's management and upper management. Between 1999 and 2005, the town's voters endorsed spending $23 million through municipal bonds to preserve land. South Nork Electric and Water has a reservoir on the western side of town with about 350 acres of land adjacent in New Canaan. In the fall, Hunters with bows and arrows a euro no more than ten at a to me a euro are allowed to hunt deer on the Wilton property in order to keep down the number of deer in the area. Wilton's town centre contains several local restaurants, boutiques, retail stores, a Starbucks, a stop and shop, and a four-screen movie theatre owned by Bow Tie Cinemas. These stores were added around 2000 next to the old Wilton Centre, which consists of the Wilton Library, the Wilton Post Office, a CVS pharmacy, 
the old post office square, and the village market. In the southern part of town, US 7 contains a commercial section. Equals neighborhoods equals, the southwest corner of town includes part of the Silverman neighborhood. Georgetown, which is primarily in Reading and partly in Western, extends a bit into the northeast corner of town. Other neighborhoods in town are South Wilton, Wilton Center, Gilbert Corners, Cannondale, and North Wilton. Equals on the National Register of Historic Places equals Cannondale Historic District, roughly bounded by Cannon, Danbury and Seeley Roads. Consists of authentic renovated 17th and 18th century buildings that were moved to the site. The train station is the only building at the site that was originally built at that location. The site itself does not hold any special historic value. David Lambert House, 150 Danbury Road Georgetown Historic District, located on the northeast of town. Herbert Street School, 157 Herbert Street, Marvin Tavern, 405 Danbury Road. Sloan Raymond Fitch House, 224 Danbury Road. Weir Farm National Historic Site, 735 Knot Hill Road located in both Wilton and Ridgefield. Wilton Center Historic District, roughly, area around JCT of Lovers Lane and Belden Hill and Ridgefield Roads The historic district includes 20 buildings and one structure over 240 acres, including the Old Town Hall Building and the Wilton Congregational Church Buildings. Demographics As of the census of 2000, there were 17,633 people, 5,923 households, and 4,874 families residing in the town. The population density was 654.3 people per square mile. There were 6,113 housing units at an average density of 226.8 per square mile. The racial makeup of the town was 95.55% white. 0.60% African American, 0.09% Native American, 2.69% Asian, 0.01% Pacific Islander, 0.27% from other races, and 0.79% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 1.53% of the population. There were 5,923 households out of which 46.6% had children under the age of 18 living with them, 75.4% were married couples living together, 5.4% had a female householder with no husband present, and 17.7% were non-families. Of all households 15.3% were made up of individuals and 6.6% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.91 and the average family size was 3.25. The age distribution is 31.5% under the age of 18, 2.8% from 18 to 24, 25.6% from 25 to 44, 27.9% from 45 to 64 and 12.2% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 40 years. For every 100 females there were 93.9 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 86.2 males. The median income for a household in the town was $197,428, and the median income for a family was $217,415. Males had a median income of $190,000 versus $71,611 for females. The per capita income for the town was $65,806. About 1.3% of families and 2.9% of the population were below the poverty line, including 1.7% of those under age 18 and 6.6% of those age 65 or over. Media, the Wilton Bulletin is a weekly newspaper published by her Sam Acorn Newspapers. Virgin Mobile Live a 24-hour online radio service licensed by Virgin Radio, is based in Wilton. There is also the weekly Wilton Village in newspaper. Education. Equals public schools equals, modern facilities include elementary schools Miller Driscoll School and Cider Mill School. There is one middle school named Middlebrook School and one high school named Wilton High School, which features accelerated classes for gifted students, 
music and visual arts courses, and a well-appointed resource center. An innovative language laboratory encourages foreign language studies, including French, German, Spanish, and Latin. They are one of the only towns in the country that still offers classical Greek. The town of Wilton has 4,151 students who attend pre-K through 12th grade in the four schools. The second elementary school teaches 3rd through 5th grade. The two elementary schools have class sizes ranging from 18 to 22 and a 19 to 1 student-teacher ratio. The middle school is for grades 6 a year 08 and features interdisciplinary instruction teams in languages and science, mathematics, social studies, computers, art, and gifted student instruction. Class sizes range from 20 to 25 students with a student-teacher ratio of 13 to 1. In the past five years, over 91% of Wilton High School graduates have gone on to colleges and universities. The mean SAT scores at Wilton High School are 584 verbal and 598 math. The schools are supported by an active PTA organization. Wilton's sports teams have won many FCIAC and state titles, and many individuals have been recognized on those levels as well. Equals private schools equals, there are three private elementary schools in town, Connecticut Friends School, a Quaker School, kindergarten through eighth grade, Our Lady of Fatima, a Catholic school, preschool through eighth grade, the Montessori School, preschool through eighth grade. Clubs and organizations, clubs and civic organizations in town include a Newcomers Club, Wilton Women's Club, League of Women Voters, Kaiwanis Club, the Wilton Kaiwanis Youth Coalition, Senior Meal Delivery, Boy Scouts, Cub Scouts, the Wilton Land Conservation Trust, the Wilton Family Y and the Moms Club of Wilton. Cultural amenities include the Wilton Historical Society, a Library Association, an Arts Council, an Audubon Society, the Wilton Singers and the Wilton Play Shop. Some church organizations at Our Lady of Fatima include the Knights of Columbus and the Columbiettes equals parks and recreation equals the Wilton Parks and Recreation Department offers a number of programs for all ages including preschool programs senior programs youth soccer and basketball there are also many walking paths including part of the Nork River Valley Trail Merwin Meadows is a picnic area for families with a pond playground and athletic field equals Wilton Little League equals Wilton Little League organizes Little League Baseball and Softball Leagues for boys and girls 5 to 12 years old, including T-Ball, Coach Pitch, Machine Pitch, A, or, AAA, and Majors Leagues. Games are played at Miller and Driscoll Elementary Schools, Cider Mill Elementary School, Middlebrook Middle School, and the Wilton YMCA. In postseason summer play, Wilton All-Star teams compete in the District 1 Little League tournaments. In 2012, Wilton's 12-year-old team won their tournament and advanced to state sectionals. Events in town, Minxter Sinks is a large, twice-a-year flea market that benefits Family and Children's Agency, 8, a not-for-profit family-serving agency that supports people and families in crisis or transitional moments. Cannon Grange, a kind of 4-H club for adults, hosts an annual fair. Ambler Farm Day an annual fall event that spotlights farm activities such as hay rides, apple slingshots, and scarecrow making contests. CNSW Pumpkin Festival, an annual fall festival run by the families of the Community Nursery School of Wilton. Launched in 1984, it features games, pony rides, and entertainment, and is the school's only public fundraiser for local scholarships. Relay for Life Transportation Equals highways equals, there are several highways that crisscross the town, including U.S. Route 7 and Route 33, which form the main north-south roadways in town. While not passing through any part of Wilton, the Merritt Parkway also serves the town via the Route 33 exit which is signed for Wilton, as well as the Route 7 exits which are signed for Danbury. Other state highways that run through Wilton are Route 53 and Route 106. Equals railroad equals, the town has two railroad stations, Wilton and Cannondale, both part of the Danbury line of Metro North Railroad. Equals buses equals, 
The town is served by seven link bus route of the Norwalk Transit District that runs between Norwalk and Danbury along the Route 7 corridor. A commuter shuttle bus during rush hours is also available between Southern Wilton and the South Norwalk Railroad Station on the New Haven Line. Notable residents. References. External links, Town of Wilton, Wilton Public Schools, Town Calendar.